the first exam that I ever used assistive technology for at Gordon. I remember getting done with the exam and walking outside and I had finished at the same time everyone else had finished, which was the first time I'd ever experienced that. The struggles that I had with my particular uh, reading processing disorder were mostly with reading speed. It would take me three to four times longer to read the same thing as like a, a student or a peer in one of my classes, which transitioned really heavily to my test taking in college later on because I would maybe understand the material just as well if not better than my classmates, but because I had to spend so much of my time focusing on the words in the problem and what the problem was actually asking, I couldn't actually get to solving the problem. And one of the programs that's helped me a lot with that specifically is Clara Read. One of the things I like about Clara is that it has a lot of customization as far as like how you use it. So I've got it mine set up because I don't like a lot of stuff on my screen. I use it for reading documents. So this particular document is one of my homeworks from one of my classes. So I can just select a block of text. Close to one million sites. So again, Adams increases the conductivity by a factor of five million. This statement is group of underscores. Truth. And it'll read the document to me, which is really, really helpful. So I can just like read a problem real quick and think about the answer instead of having to focus most of my effort on reading it. Textbooks is one of my favorite parts about the services that AMAC provides. I'm able to use PDF reader. So if I have the digital copy of the textbook, can use it to read the textbook to me. It's really, really helpful and it saved me a lot of time. Uh, all you have to do is go and open up PDF document uh, and you'll be able to read it. And uh, the actual reading process is really, really easy. It was really nice that each chapter is bookmarked so you can go and select which chapter you want. And go and then all you have to do is drag and select the text. And you can customize whether or not you have to click read first, or if you just let go, it'll read it. Although aspects of thermodynamics have been studied since ancient times, the formal study of thermodynamics began in the early 90s. And if you want it to stop reading, you just have to click. There's also some really cool highlighting functions. You can toggle which color you want to use, so you can do multiple highlights. And then if you select the same block of text, Engineering context. Although aspects of you can just click highlight and select whichever color you want. That way, if there's different things you want to color coat in your textbook, or referencing later, you can do that and then just come back and look for a particular color later. Another thing that's really cool is that you can select blocks of text and then have it saved as an audio file. That way if you want to read a particular chapter on your way to school in the car or something and play it over your speakers, you can just save it as an mp3 and then download it to your phone. If I didn't have the assistive technology, I don't even know if I would have gotten as far as I have in my education as I am right now. I've relied extremely heavily on the software to help me with reading textbooks specifically, but also just with uh, like writing papers and things like that. Because one of the things when I write a paper is I have to write the paper and that's a struggle because I have to focus on the spelling, but also if I want to review my own paper and proofread it, I have to read it again. So I use this technology and let it read to me and I can spot little errors and things and make adjustments. So it's been extremely helpful. I can definitely say I probably wouldn't be able to pass English comp if it hadn't been for the, the programs.